My wife and I were vacationing on an island in Hawaii. There was a volcano. It was spewing out lava. I was amazed by how calm, cool, and collect the residents were. They weren't even bothered by the fact that lava was just coming out of the volcano all the way down through the island into the ocean. It made me think for a minute, why are they calm, cool, and collect? Experts say that the volcano is certain to erupt once every four years. So it's something that is inevitable. I'm a natural warrior and if you're like me and you worry about things that are going to happen that are out of your control, I have a solution for you today that will help you to break that habit of worrying. Stay tuned. Next cue. Welcome to Next Cue. My name is Steven Garner. I'm going to share with you my direction for your life. I call it my cues for living a great life. There are certain things that we can't control. And I'm talking about the bad things. They're going to happen. They are unavoidable. However, I'm a firm believer that there's one thing that you can control. It is your mindset. And when you are in the midst of a difficult situation, you must learn the habit of accepting the challenges that are out of your control as reality so that it doesn't consume you. In fact, I learned this lesson from Dale Carnegie's book, How to Stop Worrying and Start Living. And he says this, when it comes to dealing with things that are certain, that are difficult, that are challenging, like the pandemic or the economic crisis that we're dealing with, or the difficult people that you deal with every day, the one thing that you must do is cooperate with the inevitable. Listen to this quote from his book. We can either accept them as inevitable and adjust ourselves to them, or we can ruin our lives with rebellion and maybe end up with a nervous breakdown. God forbid that we would have a nervous breakdown because we have not learned the habit of accepting the inevitable. In fact, when we accept the inevitable, when things are out of our control, when we can't do anything about our circumstances, I'm not advocating that you don't try to change your situation. I'm not advocating that you don't work hard to make your life better. What I'm saying is, is that when you are dealing with something that is certain, that is problematic, that is challenging, however you want to describe it, you can't change it. You need to accept it. And at that moment, that will help you to break the habit of worrying about something that you just can't do anything about. Trust me, I'm guilty of it. Learn to accept the inevitable. Cooperate with the inevitable and you will break the worrying habit, especially when it's something that's out of your control. Listen, take your cues from me and live a great life. Next cue. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, or comment below, and visit my website, nextcues.com, where you can get more motivation and coaching cues on how to live a great life. Next cue.